Hello everybody and welcome back to the episode of Isaac. Today we are taking a look at the Dream Guard. This is a character that I've had installed for quite a long time as part of the Sacred Dreams pack, but I haven't really actually done a video on in a long time. So I thought we'd check him out again because he's had quite a lot of updates, some new stuff and some new upgrades. But basically this guy's pretty interesting. We start with the sand pouch here which we can use to swipe against enemies and it will stun them a little bit and give them this sort of sand pouch effect. And when we kill the enemies it will fill up this bar on the top left here and when we go to the next level we can use that bar uh, sort of full of kind of upgrade power to upgrade various different aspects of our character um, and upgrade aspects of our sand pouch to make it more pertinent. It's a pretty cool idea. I, I really like the idea of the character. He's just a lot of fun. We uh, it was a, a big focus on trying to use our sand pouch as much as we possibly can. Um, Isaac has a chance to fire tears which split into fire jets on impact. Ooh, that's an interesting idea. I like the idea of that. Fire jets on impact. But yeah, as you can see, we'll hit the enemy, and then you can see we're getting a bit of, I think it's called Solomon's? Tomulans, something like that? Solomon's? Oh, there you go, there's the fire jets. I like that. But smaller enemies award a lot, lot less. So, higher HP enemies are what we're going to want to do. Obviously, bosses are important to kill while they've got the effect on them, stuff like that. Dude, this, this fire jets item is pretty goddamn good. I like it. But you can see that our bar is getting closer to halfway filled now. We want to be trying to fill it up as much as we can. Oh god, bad hit. Good, good, good. And there you go, we're just about halfway now. And the more we get, the better it's going to be for us later on. Right. Let's quickly grab all of these guys. Lovely stuff. Another one of those. And then we want to basically hit the boss just before it dies. We can hit him during as well, just to deal more damage to him and uh, stuff like that. But really, we want to be hitting him just before he perishes. So we've got to be really, really, really careful about how much damage we're dealing to him. That was a bad hit. Like, that is a bad amount of damage. There you go. We just about got it there, I think. That was that was close. I didn't realize how much fire damage we'd do there. But you can see that we now filled our bar and we've got a little one next to it. And we get ourselves the belt. So now heading down to the next floor, we should see a little upgrade fella that we can interact with to do some cool stuff. Um, so yeah, it, it, rather than it being an NPC or anything, it's actually just some of these here. So each one of these will cost one. Killing an enemy with Solomons will spawn a fragile sandy familiar that will attack nearby enemies and apply Solomons to a small radius. Um, sand pouch recharge time up, Solomons duration down. Sand pouch attacks will spawn a coma cloud. This cloud halts duration and stuns enemies while it collides with enemies. And double tapping the fire key will shoot a, a homing piercing sphere. Uh, the sphere deals more damage to enemies of Solomon's. The ability is recharged separately to sand pouch. This is kind of tricky. I think I'm going to go with Sandy. I think that one sounds like the best. Um, little Sandy little buddies. And uh, we get little friends on occasion. I like that idea. Good, good. Now, it does uh, change the duration of our Solomons, which is a little tricky. Oh, that was close. Good, good. Item room, what do you provide for us? God's Flesh, much, much better than it used to be now that it's been uh, buffed. So, not officially, but with a mod. Um, makes it a lot, lot better. Dude, that Solomons does not last anywhere near as long. Okay, gotta be careful. Hey, there's our little buddy. Just a chance to, to drop him. Now, does he last through rooms is my question. If he comes through rooms with us, he does. Okay, that makes him a lot, lot better. Go, my little fella. I like him. I like him. I'm hoping we can get a good few of them on the roster. Nice. And those fire shots are doing some good work. What the hell are you? I've not seen you as an enemy before. Oh, dude. He ran at me so fast and somehow my pouch missed. Okay, that wasn't great. Need some HP. HP would be ideal. Especially now I've been hit on red health as well. <laughs> Give me some soul hearts, game. At least we've got a good amount of speed. That's something to be thankful for. Oh, look at him. He's so tiny. He's so tiny. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, we are on the brink. On the brink of death, people. Good, good, good. 
take these fellas out and hopefully get a red heart drop from the end of this room. Oh, no. See, we have to get so close to enemies because of the applying the Solomons that I'm very, very scared. Oh, no HP there either. Okay. This guy's going to be tricky. Didn't really want that to happen. Oh, no, that was close. That was close. That was close. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Okay, we'll roll that back, though. We'll roll that back. That was a, a little bit of an unfortunate death, but let's not let it discourage us. We, we kind of understand the guy now, and it gives you guys a better idea of what we're getting into for the rest of this run. That was just me playing poorly. I think it's just because in this situation, I have to get so close to enemies to, like, pay off correctly with this uh, ability. I've got to really get in there. Broken disc. A bunch of terror. Honestly, while we've got terror here, let's, uh... Try and find secret rooms if we can. Oh, excuse me. I didn't realize you fired at me. You cheeky blighter. Get out of here, you. What an awful enemy you are. Curse of Midas. This is... We've had this before. This this item can be real wacky. Um, turns everything into gold. Um... It can, it can really ruin a run, but it could also make it great. Um, it's definitely one of the items that I think is most interesting. Good. Let's wait for these guys to get a bit closer. Get them both. I like the way it like, briefly pauses them in midair. Both of you can get got as well. Lovely. Open that up. Open that up. There you go. Now we've got a golden bomb waiting for us. We can use that to easily kill things while they've got Solomons on them. We have golden bombs pretty much every floor at this rate as well. Another golden bomb. As I said, everything apart from pennies becomes the golden version. But yeah, we can do like this watch. We can go boom and then boom. Makes that a lot easier to kill them in time. And again, and you drop me a golden heart as well. Thank you. Thank you. I'm already full on Golden Hearts, though. Darn. Right, we want to get as much of our bar filled as we possibly can here, so I'm going to do some extra rooms that I don't particularly have to do. I'm going to gather these two up together, hit them both with that, and boom. Hey, <laughs> save myself some time. Hey, we got a level up there. Nice. And our Golden Heart has Midas touched the rest of the room, which actually makes using this quite a bit easier. And we now have a lot of money to work with, which is rather nice. Unfortunately, getting duplicate golden bombs isn't going to do much for us. That's not a problem. Right, okay. Remember, we've got to try and kill the boss right as he's got somnolence on him. Otherwise, we won't get the full benefit. So we do have to be a little careful about when we kill him. That's a lot of fire, game. It's a lot of fire. Right, get a few more hits on him. There you go. Okay, we're good. Uh, there you go. We got him. And that'll give us a good amount. I think it did at least. Yeah, it gave us almost a half bar there. Thank you. Okay. Down we go. This Curse of Midas is proving to be a little tricky right now, but we'll, we'll prevail. Um, changes your sand pouch to a ranged attack. Kind of nice. Killing an enemy or damaging enemy with Solomons will give you a small burst charge to your pouch. Pouch allows you to store two full charges of your stand pouch. Every third stand pouch attack will perform twice in short succession. Ooh. I think I'm going to go for that. I think this is a reroll, if I remember correctly. Cool. Ooh, you need to back yourself up, my friend. We need, we need some keys. Oh, well, a key. The golden key will do. Oh, my God. Are these all golden poops now? My goodness. I think they are. Wow. Hey, we got a healing penny there. That's uh, actually pretty useful. There's that. Okay, so money's not going to be a concern at all here. 
In fact, we just got a golden counterfeit penny, so... Especially not going to be an issue now. Up to 99. Right, arcade. Open that up. Hey, got one of those hearts finally. We've been waiting on one of those. We are a very golden boy here. Play a rune I'd like. Good, good, good. We got it all. Clear rune could be lovely for us here. What are you going to give us? Anzus? I will take an... An Anzus is only two room charge? Oh, that's awesome. I will definitely be into that. I can keep that for a little while. Grab some of that money back. Okay, baby. That is... Uh, that was more than I was expecting to get out of that room. Dude. Getting hit is so powered. So powered, so powerful. I can just make the most of it here. I can just chill and apply somulans, somulans, whatever you want to call it, to every enemy here. Do my thing. They seem to be frozen forever. There you go, back up to 99. It's kind of a good idea to destroy all the poops anyways, though, because there's all these special poop varieties. Special poop, sorry, special coin varieties that I can maybe get that would actually be kind of nice to see. Not a big fan of this room. It's a little hard to hit the enemies I want to hit with what I want to hit them with. But let's just pretend it's all normal. Yeah, one more. Where's he going? Oh, can't quite hit him with the summer ones there. My sand pouch doesn't reach. No. Okay, good. Ah, I want to kill this guy because he's, he's a big dude. He'll give me more. These guys will give me only tiny amounts, but still worth it. Oh, I like that double attack it does. That double attack was a good pick. Ow, bad hit. We are not on good HP right now and do not have very many ways to get HP back. Piggy bank? Of course, of course. Honestly, a golden pill could be really good for us. I need a HP up. There's a health up. Okay, that worked out pretty well for us, I'd say. Oh, dude, dropping it on the floor gave us another, dude, suppository as a pill. I like now. I like quite a lot. <laughs> Didn't know that would work that way. Might as well take this as well, to be honest. Um, oh, we don't have any bombs. Damn. We need a golden bomb. Pretty bad. But yeah, Solar Lilith now on our, uh, on our active. Quite like it. I also seem to have a lot better tier rate than I had before. Like, a lot, lot better. And, wait, no? No, I don't? What's, what, where, where was all those tiers coming from? I don't even know. That was confusing. No bomb? What the hell? Right. Play this guy first. Wow, that was super worth my time. I can get you to uh, pay out with something cool though, right? That's not going to help, is it? You give me an item, good fella? Little dude? Oh my god. Oh, there's the bombs we're looking for, baby. Why the hell not? Right, bomb you. Just some extra pennies. Right, back we go. Back, 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 back. 
And we'll go and grab Inner Child as well. Thank you. That's a nice thing to have. There's just a bit of backup because this Curse of Midas, it's putting some pressure on us. It really is. Making things a bit trickier than it has to be. He does have someone on him, doesn't he? I think he did. Maybe not. Did we get any there? No, we didn't. He didn't have it on him. How? I don't even know how he didn't have it on him there. That's that's some bullshit. Little Spewer. Also, random golden pill. Oh, dude, Little Spewer is actually amazing, so we're always going to get golden pills from him. Right. Yeah, Little Spewer is going to be good if it spawns pills for us. Right, let's go. Okay. This run is a bit strange. Unfortunately, we didn't get a level up there because the, the way that the boss worked was weird. There you go. We got a level up there. Good, good. Right, I'd like to spam the golden pills. The estrogen up pills are uh, are really screwing us right now, though. I will say. Very nice. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it's a full heal as well. That is so, so good to see. So, so good to see. We would need a key, though. Key is uh, going to be pretty useful for us. Oh, I got something in my eye. What have I, how the hell have I got something in my eye? I'm sat on my PC. I don't even know. Ow. This this runs an actual wild ride right now. So much to keep track of. <laughs> the suppository pills are doing us real good work though, giving us more runes to use and resetting the charge of the active back to four room charge. Oh what? <gasps> it didn't use it because it wasn't in my active slot. That's that's gotta be something that could be fixed by mods, right? <laughs> that's really annoying. Hey, there's a key. Um, realistically, if I have a rune on me in any slot, it should just know. Obviously, it's a little different if you have two runes, because then you'd have to decide which one you want to do, but I don't have two runes. This is different. Um... I think I'm probably going to roll. Is there a good way to do this without taking a ton of damage? Probably not. That's Greed's butt. No, I wanted Greed's butt. God damn it. Is this still worth it until the machine disappears? Pro bombs be damned. Right. On use removes a filled heart container, adds two empty burn hearts, spawns a puddle of creep. Yeah. That's a bit terrible. Lost a lot of HP there. That wasn't really worth it. I was hoping I could get that greed's butt. That would have been very helpful, but sadly, I missed it. Good. Golden bombs there, lovely. Ah, bump me straight back out again. Broom face, interesting. 
HP. Lovely. Oh, what? Excuse me? Curse of Midas, what happened? How dare you take that away from me. Oh, got a golden troll bomb there as well. Right. Little Brimstone, we got conjoined, baby. Our damage is so low. Not dead yet, baby. Okay. <laughs> this has just been going crazy, it has. Got a lot of friends, apparently. There's another pill. Oh, I can't even pay attention to what's happening right now. Super Magnet, no thank you. We have so many friends. We did get a golden coin in there somehow. That was a terrible pill. That pill's gone as well. Keep it going. This 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 run is not the showcase of this character that I was expecting it to be. Bit of little delirium in there as well, why not? Throw that into the mix. We're not even that far into the run yet, and it's it's just chaos. Just chaos. I'm making it work. Petrified poop there, no thank you. A lot more money that we don't need, thank you. I think that worked. It did, good. Devil deal, honestly? Yes. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen, but I still found it funny. Yeah, I think I'll just take that, thank you. Right, we go. We get to get another upgrade. Adds one notch to your inventory. Okay, we don't need one notch right now. Okay. Normal enemies no longer gain someone's immunity when the effect ex um, expires. Decrease someone's immunity for bosses. Kind of interesting. Spawns a set of three low tier power ups. And we collected only once per run. Killing an enemy with solace increases damage dealt with it by 5%. Resets when leaving the room. Let's try this one. Um. Removes all your abilities and gives you one point for each. Nah. Allows you to take one ability for free and disappears from your inventory. Um. Go with that. This has been crazy. What the hell's going on? Um. Increased duration. Duration's pretty good. The cloud, though. I'll take the cloud. Okay, cool. We got some we got some stuff going on with this now. Okay, I like that. That seems good. Overall, that seems very good. We have golden bombs. We'll come back to you.
God damn, our actual tier damage is so bad. I don't even know how we're still alive, to be honest. There's been so much happening, it's just kind of impossible to keep track of. Oh, so many golden chests. I need a golden key. The thing is, there'll be golden keys in those golden chests. The worst part about it. We don't need money, goddammit. More rock, though. Not bad, not bad. There you go. Max HP. Ah, oh, Midas! Why does Curse of Midas not let me take HP? It's so evil. Give me some golden bombs and keys, please. I need something to work with. There's a bomb. Right. I'm excited. Oh my god, yes, that's so good. And it's a full health as well. Okay. I think we're about ready to go. I would like to get a golden key, though. Let's go, let's go look for a golden key first. Fly screen. Not seen fly screen before, I don't think. Oh, golden key, where are you? I needeth you. Gonna be a long episode. Right, give us a key. I'm gonna pay you out. I just want a key. Or the treasure map. Treasure map be good too. Or hand me downs for a bit of speed. I guess speed is kind of nice. <gasps> oh my god, we got the key. Sleepy pills. I go stud. Ah! Not a good idea. I love the way that they're all just filled with more golden bombs and keys. Where am I curse? It's interesting. Oh! They're not they're not soul hearts at all. Right, away we go. God damn! How did this run become this? We just want an extra slot right now, don't we? Kind of didn't want the telepills here, really. There's a golden key back there that I would like. We go grab that real quick. Oh my. Where'd all this shit come from? Brainworm? Golden brainworm? Yes, please. I will take a golden brainworm, thank you. I don't need to turn anything more into coins. Leave me alone. Right, give me that. Pop that. Then give me that. Give me that. Where did Bumbo come from? Is, is that, did I just get Bumbo from my solo will? I think I did. Oh, the telepills are scaring me. Every time I think I'm going to lose my uh, thingy. Full of Lilith. Wow. Get some trash items on occasion here. Blue map's pretty decent. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. 
That's pretty good. We'll come back to you when we have a billion pounds again. Oh, I'm not taking any damage though. What the hell? I don't even know how to keep track of what's happening right now. Bumba, I know you want coin, but chill. You can have coin soon. Frail fly. Full health's rather nice. Oh, what the hell? I went full health and automatically lost all my health in the next turn. Not fair. Right, take a bunch of these. There's another pill here. I definitely want to use that. Oh, we've got suppository again, which is good. Balls of steel actually give us some soul hearts there. Wow. Use that again there. Get a little Steven. Lovely. Just a wacky, wacky floor. Bumbo's growing big and strong. As he bloody well should be. Honestly, it's so hard to use the sand pouch now. Every now and again, everything just turns into golden stuff. And I'm not quite sure why. There's a tainted treasure room in here? Why? What's happening there? Blade Maelstrom is very good. Although, I really should have kept Virgo, to be honest, because uh, no negative pills was very nice. Not having negative pills to worry about was was pretty cushy. There's a pill there as well. Uh, give me that. Back we go. I guess I could go back to the shop at this point. I'm going to do the rest of the floor first, though, I think. Or the rest of this part of the floor. You have been converted into gold once again. Go, Bumbo. Eat what you can't and eat anything you can get your hands on. Oh, that was nice. Hill just keeps going. They all seem to be good so far, so maybe I have something else that's making them all good. Give me that. Pop that. Ow, I lost all my charges again. Why do I... Oh, no, I didn't. Paralysis. This That pill lasted so long. Right, I've got a lot of money now. Let's go back to the shop again. God damn, this has been a wild, wild run. Go, Sawblades. Do what I couldn't. Is that another pill? No, the telepills. The telepills scares me every time. Okay, the pill's gone. Now we've just got to find where the hell... Okay, it's there. <laughs> I was going to say where the hell I put that, but it's right there. Where's the shop at the... Okay, it's right here. <laughs> I'm getting so fucking flustered.
Of course, we get a restock now. We've got one more shop to go out on the next floor, so it's not too bad. Right, let's get the hell out of here. This has been just nonsense. Absolute nonsense the entire way through. The only way that this can be described. Need that brain worm. For some reason, need all of that. I'm going to do Blade Maelstrom the moment I come in here. I'm trying proc something when I can, but... I'm not super, help uh, super, super confident that's going to work. Is he dead? He is dead, okay. Bob's brain, lovely. Another pill. Ah, that that one disappeared pretty goddamn quickly. Things keep pulling stuff around. I'm not quite sure what it is. Doubles the number of held bombs. Okay, no, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna quickly do a, a run through to try and. Oh wait, no, I've already got a charge. Okay, cool. I'm I'm good to go. I'm good to go. The golden battery I was gonna search for, but we already got a charge out of that, so I'm fine. Right, we got under the level. Probably want to get another pip, right? Oh, wait, no, we've got a pip empty at the minute. Uh, ranged. Deadly spikes. Yeah, let's go with the spikes. Right, let's try and get a charge up again here. Hey, I'll take that. You watch me kill myself in this room. Very nearly. I'm going to need to keep popping this pill to try and get a, a heal, you know. The one makes you large is not good. There's the full health I was looking for. Yeah, the one makes you large is not a fan. We have a lot of friends. Keep popping this. I can't not keep popping it. It's an addiction I have. Also, it's suppository again, so we get this. Oh, I didn't charge up the battery, though. We get Yera, though. Um, Yera, I guess we'll just use in this room to get another one of these that we can just use. And then more pills that we can work with. Another pill. All out. Right. Okay. Let's keep this rolling, shall we? Because this is this has really gotten out of hand. <laughs> I keep saying it, but every floor seems to get more and more out of hand. Tank boys, baby. Why not throw them in the mix? Is that another pill? Okay, that was a very, very short-lived pill, unfortunately. Or maybe fortunately for some of you, I'm sure you're getting a bit sick of this. <laughs> oh, man. Another pill. The Midas thing is just so broken. It's so dangerous, but it can pop off so hard. It's, it's the golden pills that make it, because they're where you get all your HP and stuff. Need a full health, really. Boy, our energy. Tiny Terma. Yeah, I guess it. I've got Suppository again. Pair throw here. A little worried for this next room here. I'm worried about that battery charge that keeps coming at me. Where's my full health? 
We got Suppository again. I have to get into another room. There's too much shit going on in this room. Where's my full health? The 40 hour energies are wild as well. I don't even know if these batteries can kill me, but I feel like they can. Right. Just give me the goddamn full health. I need it. I don't want to go into another room like this. Also, this pill's endless. Okay, it finally ended, but unfortunately not really on a good note. Are you kidding? I walked into the room and immediately died. Okay, this glass thing saved me. Good. Wow, that was, that was lucky. Okay, I died again. Am I going to be saved again? No, I'm not. Well, that's it for that run. That was absolute goddamn chaos. I don't even know if you got the picture of this character, but either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, because that was mental. See you guys in the next one.